Hello everyone and welcome back to Jurassic World Evolution 2 Dominion Park. Now, I know that the um, Jurassic World Evolution videos haven't been out so frequently as of late. It's probably because I've actually just got out of hospital and um, yeah, I, I haven't been well so um, yeah, no, I, I haven't like just haven't had time to play any games because I've been very sick and stuff like that so without further ado I thought we would actually build our next bit of the enclosure which would be the herbivores so what I wanted to do was actually do a huge um, expansive bit so we've got like huge um, a huge fenced off area so we can do a tour and everything with it so with that being said, let's get this started. So what we can do, so I do this. So sort of like that would be sort of big enough for the herbivores and everything like that. So the next thing I want to do is put in huge like a huge water area for them so that we can let them enjoy the water and stuff like that. And what we're going to do, hang on, if I just do this, we're going to fence certain bits off so that like Triceratops and stuff like that can throw, um, have their own little enclosures, or uh, paddocks rather. Um, just want to do that. See, before I do that, I do need to do that so that we can have a little bit of um. Island sort of feel for it. Um, so, just I like to make sure that they can all have some water. And stuff like that. So, that will be good just like so um, and the next thing I want to do is actually put in the no I don't want the Avery I want that like that cool and do here is just give all the regions some of the foodie bits that they need so it covers basically everything
Right, so the next thing I want to do is accelerated growth and additional bays. All right, time to, uh, what do I want? I want to um, herbivores. Right, so let's just do that. And do the galleys. And I'll do the uh, where are you? The brachios. So what we're going to do is I'm going to put gates in on, yeah, okay, give me a second. Okay, yeah, that's going to be good because I can just do a path around there and, yeah, that'll be good. Cool, alright, so, okay, they can go Acknowledging asset collection there. request. The galleys go into there, the brackets can go in there as well, because that's big enough for them. And I'll do the Triceratops next, but I'm going to give them a random colour. Get the steggies a random colour too. And then while that's happening, I can just start thinking of the guests. Actually, I'll do the attractions because that's going to be the um, guided tour, park tour. Way we want to pass, and then that way we can enjoy the, the scenery a little bit more. Okay, select all, select all. Collecting asset. Asset collection request received. En route to pick up the asset. Okay. And what I'll also do when I feel like it, I will put in gates so we can have them go into each of the paddocks when we want. Which I do need 
to actually put in a gate there. Transportation underway. Speed this along a little bit. Asset transportation underway. What can be said about the Triceratops? This is one of those dinosaurs that really defines our business. People want to see them, and we want to share them with the world. Don't let that fearsome appearance fool you. Those horns are mostly for defense and impressing other Triceratops. This animal is an herbivore. It can be a star attraction or a security nightmare if it turns those horns on our fencing. Asset delivery confirmed. Release you. Release you and release you. Asset has been collected. Transportation complete. In transit. Delivery has been completed. Okay. Um, let's get a um, I don't want you, I want Asset transit. This animal, the Myasaura, is known as the good mother reptile because its fossils were first discovered in a nesting colony. And really, who doesn't love a good mother? I do, if I had one. This one's more my speed. The Oranosaurus is named after the Arabic word for courage, which is kind of my thing. This dinosaur is easy to care for and really only wants a comfortable place to eat and rest. And to be left alone. <laughs> okay. Sound like anyone you know? Asset requiring collection. Heading to pick up the asset. So we'll put the steggies in there. Triceratopses are in there. Asset transportation in progress. Confirming asset delivery. Transit has commenced. Okay, so what we can do, I don't know if this is going to work or not. Um, asset transportation complete. But we can actually put in asset being transported. Oh, this is going to work. Asset has been collected. Okay, put it here. Asset delivered. Yeah, I know the shopping coverage is a lot at the moment. Asset. asset has been delivered. I want to put you... No, that's where you are. Asset so... delivered. En route to collect the asset. Okay. Couple of Serenas. Commencing 
commencing asset transit. Uh, why that tile? Why that tile? Okay, what other dinosaurs can we put in here? I want to put the Dread Nautilus in there, so... Transit. A couple of Dreadies. Sisters. Asset to be collected. Asset transportation complete. Release. 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 Transportation underway. So we've built the huge Herbivore paddock with other paddocks. Well, it's one huge enclosure, but it's the perimeter fence and the paddocks that you have to go through to view all the dinosaurs. So, yes. Asset transported. Cool. Oh, he's in a tree. I think he's trying to merge with the tree, become one with the tree. So, yeah, so that is that episode, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. I know it's been a quick one, but I actually enjoyed doing that. So I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.